everybody. Don't mind our very messy studio where we film everything. But today, we are recreating old photos and old outfits that we wore when we were literally like four. We some were like, of them are very we were, some of them are very funny. So we're recreating, I think, four outfits. We're gonna be doing that whole process, recreating the outfits, showing you guys what we wore, which, why? But also recreating the photos so you guys can get a giggle out of that. Anyway, let's get to it. Hello. This Hello. is the first outfit. We're Can wearing we? gauchos in this photo. Gauchos. And so in order to recreate this, I had to buy an adult pair. Man, are they hideous. And just so you know, we had to DIY some of these things. It was not us that did them. It was our lovely team member, Cassie, who did all these DIYs. So shout out to her. Everybody give her a good, nice compliment in the comments for doing all these DIYs for her. I don't even know what this is. Oh, I think it's the shawl. I just have a distinct memory of wearing these pants like every day when I was like five. But look at that! The underwear lines are real too. What? Oh my. Yeah, that's a look for sure. Mm-hmm. Update. I am a bit concerned about the fact that I could probably fit my whole body in one pant. We ordered a small, but these look huge. Literally. Bet, how much do you wanna bet? Do they I'm say about, they're small? I'm about to put my body in one pant leg. Woohoo! I actually think that like when they're cinched, when you I wear know. when you wear scrubs and stuff, like I wonder if army pants are the same, but when you wear scrubs, they like literally come in one size and you just have to cinch them till they fit. I hope they cinch. Are you the glitter, the giant gemstones? I mean, are you kidding me? Woohoo! Woohoo! A win on those! Can you guys see this? They kind of look comfy. They look cute. Camo pants for the win. I literally had my hair like clipped back like this. Here you go. Swooped out of my face. This is, I mean it doesn't look terrible, but maybe not how I would style my hair every day. As I'm sitting here waiting for my crimper to heat up because my hair was crimped in the photos, I am realizing that these pants look gigantic on me even with the cinch. They don't even slightly resemble the photo. I mean, the, besides the camo, the rest of it doesn't really resemble the photo very much. <laughs> Time to crimp my hair. This thing is huge. I don't know how long it's been since I've crimped my hair. A really long time. Look at this, I actually kinda like it. It's kinda cute. This side, for some reason, is much flatter than this side. I'm not entirely sure why. Okay, so this is the full fit for me. Even down to the shoes. I don't know if y'all ever saw these. They're actually highly comfortable. So, uh, low-waisted. Can't wear the last time we're low-waisted either. I look very 2000s. What do you think? It's cute. Uh-huh. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Ooh. Final outfits for this one. I've never felt so not cute. I think it's the pants that do it for me. I really thought they were gonna be cute, but they are truly just not cute. Now we're gonna try to recreate the photo that these outfits were in. Um, your left foot's in front of your right. Me and her first. It's like, your one hand's like, no, more. Like, oh, yeah. We got it! One outfit down! <laughs> oh, your gay's gonna go down to your ankle! <laughs> I have never felt more like a grown up child in my life than when I'm wearing this dress. <laughs> Who gave us permission to pop off like this? Ooh, so cute. Yet. We have like these little beaded headbands that I remember wearing in like third grade. Then we have knee high white socks. And oh, are you ready for this? Little, what are these called? They're like Mary Janes or something. These little like closed toed buckle shoes. I literally can't. I can't get over this. I have so many questions, but I think my biggest one is why did we do this to ourselves? Fairness, this was like it was a cute thing so back cute back then. Like we were the cutest dressed children. <laughs> the problem is that we're just not that cute anymore. That's it. We decided to add a little tail here to tighten it up a little bit so it didn't look so big. I also have a tail. That headband looked kind of rocks though for you. <gasps> what? Really? Hmm, so random person. 
Jason just walked in this room, took one look at this, and was like, We're sitting here realizing we, we don't, don't know, know which one's who? which in the photo. So we don't know who to pose as what. We're just gonna hope for the best. I think she's the one making the funnier face. Yeah. And I'm the one that's smiling. You're like, like that. No, you're like this. No, no. You're the one look doing the, look this. Look at your face. No, I'm the one doing this. No, you're the one doing this. Look at your freckle right there underneath your nose. What? Ah! I don't know. We should go ask go dad. dad. Oh my gosh. I missed this. Oh gosh. I Who's want you? this back. Brooklyn is on the, this is Brooklyn. I, I told you, I told you. Nice, wow. <laughs> Do you remember like these dresses too? Do you remember these dresses? With your long mermaid hair. Little rose. But you guys look so cute. No, we don't <laughs> look cute. No, we don't. I love this. <laughs> Much harder than it looks, you it guys. Is much and it's freaking hot outside too. Time for the PJs. Jump. Rockin' rockin'. This was our birthday party, right? We wore these for our birthday party when we were younger. Wow, we were so cool. Out of all the outfits we've had to wear, this one is by far the best. I look like a diva. This is like these PJs are you. I'm kind of digging it. Oh, you look rich, posh, couture, vogue. Oh, <laughs> actually, it's a good color on you, too. Oh, thank you. How dare I almost forget my wonderful necklace. Your homemade beaded necklace. Oh, no. You know you're all jealous of this one. You know you all want this necklace. What can I say? True art. I love how everything matches. My hair matches everything it, so it's nicely. Aesthetic. We just realized that our hair was in like low buns, two low buns. So we're gonna have to try to make that happen. Bailey's gonna have a little bit more of a struggle since her hair is tiny oh, short. A bit of a struggle. I'm just gonna whip mine up like nobody's business. It can be quick, easy. We'll see how Bailey fares. Buns have been accomplished. So this photo was taken in the dark. It was at a sleepover for one of our friends who ironically is no, now- it was our birthday. No, it was Shelby's birthday. And she's now getting married and I'm her bridesmaid like next month. So kind of crazy how times have changed. But the only darkest place we could find was the shower. <laughs> so we're taking it in the shower. Ow, ow. Let's go. Okay. Woo -hoo. Woo -hoo. Picture number three. Last, but certainly not least, our swimsuit outfit. This one will be probably the most different because we were the youngest in this photo, number one, and number two. We're not children anymore. Our bodies are very different than when we were children. <laughs> and this isn't a swimsuit. I would hope so. It'll be interesting. Rylan over here being a trooper, blowing up our floaty. Also, these swimsuits turned out so cute. Was not anticipating these being cute, but look. Very, very, very no, cute. No, I feel like this is such a flattering swimsuit. All right. This is gonna take forever. Okay. Oh my word. Done! Well, they don't necessarily match, but you know. You get the general idea. Yeah. Yes, this is real. This, this is, is such a look. One. Great. <laughs> that's funny. All right, guys. That's a wrap, people. We are done. We'll show you all of the before and after photos right now. Hopefully you enjoyed those old outfits. If you want us to do another version of a video where we try and recreate old outfits and make them fashionable, comment down below and let us know. I think I'm gonna go get in the pool. Honestly, me too.